Hey friends, welcome to CIC's Pause and Ponder. We're so glad you're here. My name is Xavier. I'm the youth and young adults pastor here at CIC. Today we're pausing to ponder on Psalms 31 verses 23 to 24. It reads, Love the Lord, all his godly ones. The Lord watches over the faithful, but fully repays the one who acts arrogantly. Be strong and let your heart take courage, all you who wait for the Lord. Who is better fit than David to challenge and motivate us to go after God? They have gone through various trials in his life. He knew what it was to be in trouble. He knew what it was to be in a hard place. David experienced much suffering, but in that suffering, David also experienced God's rescuing power and grace over his life. Something happens in all of us when we practice thankfulness. It changes the lenses and the filter which we see life through. It expands our vision on the greatness of our God and the problems to come minute in light of God's greatness. David challenges and calls us all who are godly ones in Christ to love the Lord. To love God has many arguments to enforce it. We can love God because of the excellence of His character, because it's such a pleasant and joyful thing in our life to do so. We can love Him because it's so beneficial to do so. We can love Him because it equips us for service. We can love Him because it cleanses us of our sins. We can love Him because it strengthens us in our daily day life. And most of all, we can love Him because He will guide each and every single step of our lives. So. David challenges you and me to go after him. He reminds us that God is faithful and that he watches over his children, but he repays those who act arrogantly. It is true, God resists the proud, but gives grace to the humble. It's both an encouragement to praise God, but also a warning to those who refuse to do so. So friends, you and I can be strong and our hearts can take courage because God does strengthen the trusting and hoping in heart. So today, this week, or whenever you're facing a hard time, take courage despite, despite the hard time because God does come true for those who wait for him. So remember, take courage and love the Lord, the one true God.